Hey everybody, Mike Ciparini here, Chippers Island Adventures, and I'm here with Corey Weatherton. Hey everybody. From, from Integra, and he is going to go over the brand new, newly debuted Integra Odyssey 22C. Yeah, so we introduced that here at the Tampa Super Show this year in 2023. And kind of the impetus behind this was uh, there are a number of uh, more cost affordable class C's, if you will, that are out in the market today. And we wanted to get into that segment, but at the same time still have a lot of the amenities uh, that Integra is known for, really the, that build quality that exists. And so uh, this 22C floor plan, uh, bumper to bumper is gonna be 25 feet, two inches long. And uh, one of the hallmarks with Integra that we've always done is a one piece seamless fiberglass front cap. Uh, so this is uh, quite expensive, quite honestly, uh, this component here itself. Class C's, as you probably Probably know if you're into motorhoming RVing uh, this horizontal seam that exists behind this front cap is the number one leak pot spot on a class C and so our walls go all the way in front our bunk platforms come all the way over we slide this on like a glove on a hand the hands the structure the structures there um, and so we slide that to protect your investment and really that is a single most important thing I, in my opinion anybody could do building a class c and even at this lower price point we wanted to carry that over just to protect your investment um, all of our odysseys all of our uh, odysseys have an easy drive package uh, three components that we're doing to give you a, a ride and handling enhancement we want to be the quietest riding best handling at every price point well this this only has two of the components so we left off helwig helper springs if you're familiar with our odyssey um, you know that we have uh, rubber isolation mounts on both sides of the rear axle, the only manufacturer that does that to reduce road noise and vibration, and then the computer balance drive shaft to get rid of some of the white noise on the inside. So uh, awesome exterior, short, mobile, you can get in and out of anywhere, uh, as well as the, the two plus three warranty. Uh, so we're seeing some manufacturers offer two year warranties on their class B vans, uh, but still one year on their class C's and A's. But with Integra, we give you a complete two camping seasons. Uh, that way, if there is a hiccup along the way, um, we're able to take care of it. So I can tell you that if we would lose money doing that, we'd be like everybody else and just do a one year, but we give you a two year warranty. So exterior wise, it's on the E450 chassis. That's going to be uh, somewhat unique at this price point as well. Other manufacturers are on 350 uh, to keep the cost down. Uh, but we are doing, uh, sorry about that phone ring, we are doing the E450 to give you a higher GVW. Cargo carrying capacity on this is over 4,000 pounds. Wow. And so for a Class C, that is quite incredible. That is wow. Inside, you're going to see that uh, we did not skimp. We carried our Integra, Integra cabinetry over to this um, Odyssey SE. Uh, it's a fine construction build. You've got a 13,000 BTU air conditioner. Um, key thing about this one though um, is it does not have an inverter. There again at this lower price point we omitted that for you. Um, optional uh, 200 watt solar panel with a dual controller to uh, charge your house battery and your uh, your uh, chassis battery and if your chassis battery is full it'll divert it all to your house battery. Yep, in? we can go on inside. I'll follow you guys. Yep, so inside uh, we carried the Odyssey front cap over to this Odyssey SE. Uh, we have been using this style front cap now for uh, over six years. It, uh, it's automotive style, that uh, window that goes in there. Exactly like the cab chassis, there's about a quarter inch recess, three quarter inch lip. Uh, we put Cicaflex around that. Uh, just like they use on that that way Cicaflex as it cures it's still flexible so as this cap buffets a little bit in the wind the chassis buffets a little bit uh, we end up not having uh, leaks or cracks in our windshield so we've had a lot of success with that as i mentioned uh, we are using the integra cabinetry on the inside um, 13,000 BTU convection microwave oven great thing about that is you don't have your your heating element right up against your pizza with a burn strip uh, down the center of it and then two burner LP cooktop uh, this does have 12 volt tank pad heaters on the holding tanks and uh, you have a RV queen size bed in the rear uh, the only slide in the uh, in the coach and that is one that you're gonna have to fold the bed okay and you want to talk about the bathroom or yep can do that. 
Um, yeah, in the bedroom. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So as we're in the bedroom, you're going to notice that uh, we do have we do have pantry area that we've used here. Uh, some competitors build this floor plan. They do not have this pantry area. They just they just have their their wardrobe in this area. As we come back into the bedroom, we actually um, have have a very spacious wardrobe. Um, two folks can easily fit a lot of clothes in there, a lot of shoes in there, and then also um, the two deep drawers. So um, plenty of overhead cabinetry. Um, that's going to be your your bedroom area. As we come into uh, the bathroom, one of the great things about our bathrooms is um, they are some of the, the brightest in the industry. Uh, we're always going to have a window in our bathroom, uh, skylight as well as your exhaust fan. That way, as an individual, uh, could be somebody putting on makeups, could be somebody shaving, combing their hair. Um, you don't have to use your electricity on that. Um, it is it is a little bit more compact, but there again, we're talking about a 25 foot motorhome, and uh, this is plenty of uh, storage. Your uh, vanity, or excuse me, yeah, your uh, medicine cabinet here. Uh, some manufacturers at this price point, they're just going to give you a mirror. We give you the cabinet, and then um, down below, we've got storage underneath as well. Mm. So I'm going to put in a couple two cents here. I have an Odyssey 24B. That bathroom is just a, a tad smaller than mine, and my bathroom is a good size bathroom. So what I'm saying is that's a really good size bathroom, especially for the size. This bedroom area is outstanding. It's an outstanding innovation. And what's cool is you actually have end tables on the bed yep. with wireless charging and USB. It helps it okay. pop up like you're on So what that is is wireless charging with a USB port underneath on both sides. That's it. I'll tell you this. I, I like this. Yeah. Definitely you know, for so. what it is, it's it's, and this is act. This is great. Yeah. So I think that's so fabulous. definitely very similar to your twenty. To be able to utilize it as both a pantry. Yeah. So you don't lose your pantry space, and then you got the wardrobe. It's just unbelievable. I think it's awesome, and that's deep. That is very deep. So what a great little rig we have here. Um, and basically it has a lot of the storage that you see on the regular Odysseys. Uh, one big large compartment in the rear. So thank you, Corey, for showing me this rig. I, I like it. It's a, I think this is going to be a big seller. The number one Integra Odyssey is a 24B as far as I know, correct? That is true. And I think it, this is going to give it firm competition, no doubt, because it's a good size and everything you want is in this. Yeah, definitely. So thank you, Corey. Yeah, thanks for having us.